what's going on everybody jake the happy snake here and welcome to episode 6 of pokemon trainer jake last time i went through route 32 i battled all the trainers there and i caught my third team member which was a whooper that i named aquasand and i did train him off screen i went back and i rematched all of the trainers that i have fought so far in the game and i got him up to level 15 and also, a couple other things happened uh, just before I started training Aquasand, and I actually got these two things on camera, and I'm going to show those right now. Alright, so I just encountered a Mareep, and I would like to attempt to catch this Mareep. I'm going to go ahead and use Water Gun. Uh, she's using Thundershock, but that's not going to affect Aquasand, so yeah, okay, so very good. Um, okay, okay, yeah, sure, that, I'm totally fine with that, actually, just keep using, the, just keep using Thundershock, um, or Thunder Wave. So, yeah, I really would like to have an electric type in my team, I, I like to have the four basic types, so grass, fire, water, and electric, and then of course a flying type Pokemon, in this case it's going to be Pancake, and then the six Pokemon I just kind of, you know, I, I just kind of uh, find a unique typing, a, a unique Pokemon for, for the six Pokemon. But, uh, yeah, so I really need an Electric type, and Mareep is, like, the perfect choice. I know Mareep might be kind of overused in the Johto region, but I'm totally fine with that. Uh, so, let's attempt to... Right, I don't have any Pokeballs. Okay, well, I'm guessing I'm using my only Great Ball. If this doesn't work, then that's really unfortunate. And it worked. Very good. Okay, um, I need to stock up on Pokeballs in case I happen to actually... Uh, in case I actually happen to find a shiny, I think you can find shinies in Poke MMO. But uh, I'm gonna give this Maripa a nickname. I'm going to name her after a Star Trek captain because this Marip is female. So the only I I'm only counting the original five series for for the Star Trek for the Star Trek franchise. Uh, but the only female captain in the original five series is Ca Captain Catherine Janeway. And so that is what I'm going to be naming this Marie. I'm going to be naming her Janeway. So yeah, that is my fourth team member. And now I'm actually going to be training uh, Aquasand and Janeway off screen. So it's going to take twice as long uh, to get them up around the same level as Grassy and Pancake. But uh, yeah, that is my fourth team member. Right after I stopped recording, I'm not even joking, I literally just stopped recording and the egg hatched. If I had known that was going to happen, I would have just kept the recording going. Like, I, I, look, 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 I've moved, like, one step. Um, so I didn't get the full hatching on screen, unfortunately. That's actually really unfortunate. But now I have a Togepi in my party, so that's cool. Uh, I'm, I'm not going to be using the Togepi at all, uh, like, on my, on my team or anything. Uh, Togekiss would be a cool Pokemon to have. Uh, but I'm not gonna be bothered with that. Anyways, now I will see you yeah, once I've trained up Aquasand and Janeway. So yeah, I caught my fourth team member right before I started training Aquasand. And literally right after I caught Mareep, the Togepi egg hatched. So yeah, I, I, I was kind of hoping that that was actually gonna happen while I was literally adventuring. Like, I, I was hoping that wasn't gonna happen while I was training. But you know what? It's okay. So yes, I have a Togepi now, which is level 1. And I trained Janeway, the Mareep, up to level 14. And I did that on purpose because Mareep actually evolves into Flaffy at level 15. So I wanted to have Mareep for at least one level. So yeah, I went back and I rematched all of the trainers that I have fought so far. Except for this guy right here because I'm actually going to battle this guy again in just a second. So yeah, uh, Aquasand is level 15 and Janeway is level 14. I'm going to put Janeway in the front. And yes, I know I battled this guy at the end of the last episode, but I do want to battle him again just because this is a bird keeper and Mareep is an electric type and it's just a good matchup. So yeah, here we go. The badge is from Fos- uh, wait a second, I don't need to read that, I read it at the end of the last episode. Alright, so bird keeper Peter, and because I went back and literally rematched all the trainers, like I'm not even joking, like I went as far back as Youngster Joey, I went back and I and I rematched all of the sages in the Sprout Tower, I rematched the two gym trainers in the gym. I couldn't rematch the Elder, and I couldn't rematch Falconer, which I guess makes sense. Um, but yeah, so I got a lot of money. I did have to buy some potions and, uh, you know, stuff like that. So I had to spend a little bit of money, but I did get lots of money. And I also sold the Shell Bell that I got. I don't remember, I don't really remember what episode that was that I got that. Um, 
So, I'm pretty confident that Janeway is going to level up at the end of this battle. So, I think this is going to be the only battle in the whole series that we're going to see Janeway as a Mareep. And there we go, level 15. And she wants to learn Charge. Uh, no, I'm not really interested in teaching her Charge. So, yeah, and also, I found a big root uh, when I was when I was training. Like, I... I, I I defeated a few wild Pokemon, and one of the wild Pokemon that I killed, I actually found a big root, so that's kind of cool. Anyways, that is it. I know what my weaknesses are. Yeah, so do I. Pokemon battling. Anyways, here we go. Janeway is evolving. This is the first evolution of the series, and it's kind of funny. It's of a Pokemon that I caught at the beginning of this episode. But yes, this is the first evolution. So Janeway is now Flaffy. We didn't see her as a, as a Marie for very long. I mean, I, I did, because... I, you know, I trained her a lot. It took a while. I caught both her and Aquasan at level 8, so it did take a while, but... Anyways, now I'm gonna put Aquasan in the front, and now we can actually get to the main purpose of this episode, and that is going through the Dark Cave. So, and I actually did buy some Repels, too. I think I have three, because I don't really feel like... I don't really feel like running into any wild Pokemon, so... Yeah. Anyways, and I just realized it shows the amount of steps you have left... After using the repel, which I actually really, really like. That is really cool. Uh, so. Let's go ahead and battle this guy. The first trainer of the Dark Cave. Whoa, what a surprise. I didn't expect to see anyone here, even though there's people everywhere. What do you mean you didn't expect to see anybody here? Hiker Daniel. So he has an Onyx. Level 12. This won't be an issue for Aquasan. I'm gonna go ahead and use Water Gun. It's four times effective. Bulldoze. Uh, a critical hit, of course. Lower my speed. Oh, and you have Sturdy. Whatever. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, let's use Water Gun again. My shot doesn't have per. It doesn't have 100% accuracy. I don't know what it. It's like 90 or 85, maybe. I'm not really sure. But anyways. Yeah, as I mentioned when I caught Aquasan in the last episode, I like water and ground type Pokemon. Swampert has always been one of my favorite Pokemon. This hiker has a Fanfy, wow. You don't normally see Fanfy this early in Johto. I think you can catch it pretty early in Crystal, but I think that's the only Johto game you can do that. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and heal up here. I have three potions. I, have, I did buy one super potion. Headbutt. Okay. Oh boy, that's not good. Uh, trying to think what I should do. I'm gonna switch out here to... Let's go to Tutter. I'll use one more potion. Um, that's the problem. I'm gonna have to start buying more potions. Actually, potions are gonna... They're gonna start becoming useless. So I'm gonna have to start buying super potions, but... Go to my newly hatched Togepi and... Uh, I'll use one more potion. And normally, going through Johto, after the Togepi egg hatches, I would go back to New Bark Town to get the, a Neverstone from Professor L, but he doesn't give you that in PokeMMO, so yeah. Uh, and I could really use that because pressing B uh, after every time Grassy tries to evolve, it's not really annoying in PokeMMO because it's pretty fast, but it, will, it would be nice to get a Neverstone eventually. Anyways, Water Gun the Fan Fee, and there we go. He goes down, and that's going to be a level up. Level 16 for Aquasan. And he wants to learn Slam. Um, yes, I definitely... Yeah, I'll get rid of Mudsport, 100%. I do, don't want Mudsport. I think that's a completely worthless move. It it, it weakens electric, I think electricity's power or whatever. Which doesn't make sense, because... Uh, ground types are immune to to electric types, so you don't really need electric power to be to be reduced. Uh, anyways, so I guess there's another hiker, so I guess I'll keep I'll keep Aquas in the front for now. You're headed to Azilia, are you? Let my Pokemon see if you are good enough to battle. I know my Pokemon are good enough to battle, but if you wanna if you, if you wanna make sure, then fine. That's your prerogative, Hiker Russell. Russell Hans, who was an amazing Survivor player. Uh, I love. I, I I honestly loved watching him play. That's how I would play. I think if I was on Survivor, I would honestly play like that. Like you know, you got one chance. You might as well play hard, and you know, you're not out there to make friends. You're out there to win the game. 
Uh, so, you know, that's what I would try. It's a good way to, it's a good way to play, honestly. It's, um, anyways. Bonsley! Huh. Interesting. We're gonna be having an opportunity to fight Bonsley's Evolve form eventually. Uh, that's not gonna be for a little bit. But, it's, it, 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 I, that's one thing I really like about Poke MMO. We're seeing Pokemon that we don't see, like, we don't normally see Bonsly. I don't even know how you can get a Bonsly in Heart, Gold, and Soul, Silver, because one time recently I tried getting one by by making an egg for, with a Ditto and a Sudowoodo, and I was expecting to get a Bonsly egg, and it was a Sudowoodo egg. The egg hatched and it was Sudowoodo, and I was like, wait, what? I didn't think this is what was gonna happen. Um, so yeah. Anyways, there we go. Okay, I think Aquasand has had enough screen time for now. So let me put up Janeway. I'm a little scared to do this. Because are we I don't know. Are we gonna find another hiker? Oh, it's a fire breather. Oh, we will see a Pokemaniac too that has a slow poke. This guy's really upset about Supersonics. Confuse uh or Supersonic. Or Zubat! Zubat Supersonic. I, I'm not making any sense. Fire Breather, uh, Bill. I was gonna say Fire Breather Phil. Wait. Wait, what? What? What's Reactive Gas? What is that actually? I, I actually don't know what that does. Okay. Well, I guess we'll find out soon. Clear Smog. I forget what that does. Oh, it's a, it's a damaging attack. I thought it was a status move. And... Surprised that knocked out the coughing. It did less than half the first turn, but whatever. Janeway acquired static? Okay. No problem. No problem at all. Okay. There we go. Not an issue. And level 16 for Janeway. Very, very nice. She wants to learn charge again. No, I don't want to teach her charge. Thank you very much. I'm flamed. I flamed out. Yes, that, in fact, you did. Okay. So, we got a great ball. I think I, I bought some Pokeballs off screen, too. Like, three or something. Um, we got an item over here. My repels effect. Yes, I do want to use another one. That's a great... Uh, it's nice that it asks me like it does. Starting in black and white, too. We have a lure here. Okay, so that's definitely not there in a Heart Gold Soul Silver. I don't know what's normally there, if there is anything there. Um, anyways, this is the Pokemaniac. I probably should have healed before I started this. Pokemaniac Larry. This guy's got the same name as my dad. So should I heal or should I just go for it? I don't think Janeway's gonna survive one attack, so... Yeah, that's it! Ah, darn it. Okay, that's fine, whatever. We'll go with Grassy now. We will go with Grassy, and I'm going to use Razor Leaf. And that is it for Slowpoke. And that's level 19 for Grassy! Very, very nice. My poor Pokemon. So anyways. Every Friday you can hear Pokemon roars from deep inside the cave. Wait, is that actually true? That is... Very interesting if it is true. Uh, I'll put Chagrita back in the front. I don't... No, I guess there's no more Poke... There's no more trainers to fight. Um... So in that case, I actually... No, I'll keep... Mm, I'll put Pancake in the front, actually. So there's one more trainer to fight before we make it to Azealia. There's a couple of Apricorns there that I'm going to pass on. No, I don't want to use another Repel. I came through the cave, but I still have plenty of energy left. Okay. Sounds good to me. Hiker Anthony. He's got a Geodude. I was expecting you to have him a Machop. Um, I'm going to be using Pancake a lot in the gym. The Azilia gym is a bug type gym. So I don't really. I, I'm gonna be using her for most of the gym, so I'm gonna just. Gonna use Grassy here. 
Yeah, whatever, you have sturdy, that's fine. I'll go ahead and use tackle. There we go. It is raining. Yeah, no kidding. Okay, now you have him a chop, of course. Yeah, of course, it has to be my it has to be my luck. That's whatever. That's fine. It's totally fine. Seismic toss. Okay, one more razor leaf. We'll do the trick. And last Pokemon is another Geodude. Perfect. Okay, so we're gonna use Razor Leaf again. And that is gonna be it for. The, and that's a critical hit. Nice. And there we go. There we go. Whoa, you've got more zip than me. Wow, that is quite the compliment. Thank you very much. Okay, we can get out of here. And we are now officially in Azilia Town. Who are you? You don't know us? We are Team Rocket. What? We broke up a little while ago, or we broke up a while ago? Give me a break. We have not broken up. Actually, we did once, but we have come back to pursue Giovanni's ambition. Enough talking. Shut up and just beat it. Just beat it. Beat it. Okay, I'm sorry. Anyways, so that guy's blocking what appears to be a well. Uh, this is a Zillia town. I'm going to heal, and then I am going to end off the episode. So, that was a pretty productive episode. We made it through the Dark Cave. We evolved our newly caught Mareep into a Flaffy. And next time on Pokemon Trainer Jake, I am going to be seeing what's going on with Team Rocket. This is Azalea Town. That's the gym, but there's somebody standing in front of the gym. And it's not the person that we actually see right now. It's somebody else if we try talking. Do you know about Slowpoke Tail? I heard it's tasty. Aren't you glad I told you that? Yeah, I'm so glad. Uh, so anyways, that's it for now, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I will see you all back here on uh, on Wednesday for the next episode of Pokemon Trainer Jake. So thanks, guys, for watching. I will see you all then. Peace out.